Thank you for joining me. I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a beautiful card. First thing I want to do is use uh, my watercolor paper here and I'm going to wet it with just simply dipping that brush into water. Next I can come over and pick up some of my pretty orange colors here. A little bit of orange and um, cad red light pulling this across and I get the beautiful colors that come in a morning glow and being up in a wooded area can be such an inspiration. See just as the sun comes up how that comes in and I'm pulling this back and forth across. I'll add a little bit more color while it's quite bright there. What happens is it'll dry lighter. So watercolors dry lighter, acrylics dry darker and that'll work just perfect for me. I'm going to come right along the edge. Now while that's still damp I want to rinse my brush and I can come in pick up a little ultramarine blue, a little bit of indigo and think about putting a mountain in there. So I'm going to come right along the edge just a little bit of color on that brush pulling these around and you can do just very easily some quick mountains that go up there. It's fun to do all kinds of greeting cards for the holidays or just to say you're um, thinking of someone special. I'm going to pull this along the edge to get a little bit of the edge of the water line. I can put a little bit more blue in there. It can be pretty. And if you do a lot of these cards, each one will vary. It's a wonderful way to get your confidence in painting. And I'm going to pull this right on around. While it's wet, it'll diffuse up. The nice part with watercolors is you're working, you can come back in and add more and more pretty layers. I can also come in, I can lift off a little bit of color to make it look like there's a little bit of light. With a swish, swish of the brush I can come in and add some trees. So I'm going to come right in here just lifting up very easily. You can see there's some distant tree line in there. So I'm not doing um, a whole lot of detail to create those. Pull it down the reflection few more trees here in the background. Think of just how fun it is to take your paints along when you're um, maybe going on a winter vacation. Look out and see the gorgeous beautiful skyline that you can see and the colors. You'll start looking at things differently when you're out. The colors again that I used were some a little bit of orange. I used um, a little bit of my ultramarine blue. I've got some indigo in here easy to create that beautiful mountain scene. I hope you'll join me on public television.